the Orin Nailer Brins Shader. So if we go up into our material editor and go into our shader uh, and pick the shader here, this Orin Nailer Brin Shader is a variation of the Blin Shader. And this shader is really used for uh, matte type of objects or dull objects. So it can be used for things like terracotta, uh, fabric, uh, rubber, things like that, clay, clothing, things of that nature. And it has all the basic uh, parameters um, that we've discussed in earlier videos here in our basic parameters and our speckler highlights. However, it does have an advanced diffuse area. And so for the diffuse color, we can set the level of diffuseness. Uh, so how much color is coming through on the diffuse color and its level of roughness. And so the roughness then is uh, basically when we increase the level of roughness, uh, it will make the material become less shiny. So the higher this number is, the less shiny it will be. And uh, so the diffuse level uh, then is really um, our amount, uh, our diffuse level is the amount of brightness of our diffuse color. And that's been covered in earlier videos. So essentially, this um, is the setup the same way as every, many of the other shaders, uh, except for this makes a duller matte type of material, uh, typically used in things like uh, ceramics and terracotta and fabrics and clothing uh, and rubber and such similar type materials.